see right now on the temperature map that there is nice mild weather in the Mississippi Delta temperatures in the 40s and 50s and then we're talking 30s as we get closer to the peach state. So the two air masses colliding are allowing spotty showers to fall from the atmosphere. Not a complete washout, but you can see that the general motion here continues to stream up moist moisture from the south and west. Now we're not talking about any kind of clash of air masses, but we are talking about spotty showers sticking around for most of your afternoon. Rain forecast shows the same. We do have those showers in the forecast through 11 a.m. Still looking at the bulk of that moisture, very scattered and spotty through 4 p.m. this evening, closer to Anniston, Gadsden, Alex City, and into the Chattahoochee Valley around the Auburn campus. Most areas will dry out by tonight and heading into early Monday morning. We have fair skies, so temperatures will be on the cool side on Christmas Eve morning. Into Christmas Eve evening, we'll have clear skies, so we do expect temperatures to drop into the mid to upper 30s on Christmas morning, but I don't think we're going to see freezing temperatures widespread. This morning is 48 in Aliceville, 46 in Utah, 50 in Tuscaloosa and 51 in Birmingham, but we're still in the 30s up by 59 in Gadsden, Pell City and Talladega. We're in the upper 30s this morning. Definitely a chill in the air enough for the jacket. I put more emphasis though on that umbrella in case you're going to be outdoor shopping. You will catch spotty showers, especially in between about 10 a.m. and 1 p.m. in the atmosphere. That's when we're going to see prime scattered showers, maybe a tenth of an inch, a quarter at best after all is said and done today. So not a real soaker. It'll just be more of a nuisance, I think, for folks shopping outside. A good mix of clouds and sun though in the afternoon on Christmas Eve with a high of 54, 58 degrees on Christmas Day. Very mild. I know a lot of kiddos will be envious of this forecast. 60s on the day after Christmas, and then we're talking about an impact day. Storms arriving Wednesday night and into Thursday.